these are the things that I think anyone who hasn't read The Mystery of the Shemitah will, will really be surprised at the other kinds of signs that you've seen when you look back at history. This is what grabbed my attention. Yeah. You know, we, we were familiar with, from the Harbinger, we, we, knew, we learned a, a little bit about the Shemitah, but what you introduced there with the rise and fall of empires yes. and, and the history of these towers yes. and so forth. If yeah. people have not read The Mystery of the Shemitah by now, th this is the time to read it. Yeah, there's even a, another one which is, people don't realize that the Shemitah is actually linked to end time prophecy. It's, it's a missing key because the, the, the key of the, the last part of end time prophecy we call the tribulation period. Well, how long is that? A seven year cycle linked to Daniel's 77s, which is linked to the Shemitah. So the Shemitah is actually, and there's one of the mysteries called the mystery of the seventh Shemitah. And that is every seventh Shemitah, you have a mega Shemitah called the Jubilee. And so this cycle is actually linked to restoration of land when you lost. Well, this cycle gives the exact time parameters of when the land of Israel was restored to the Jewish people in 1917. Follow it through. It, it, the next one is 1967. You know, follow through. And then now I'm not being dogmatic, you know, but, but it doesn't have to continue. But if it did, where would it take us? It would take us, the seventh Shemitah is 2015. And then the, the period going after, which in each period, each cycle has been a major war in the Middle East, gigantic, focused on Israel, and a prophetic major end time event. Jonathan Kahn, it's such a treat to be with you. you you've become, I believe, not just a, a national treasure, but an international treasure for the work you've done on the Harbinger and Isaiah 910 Judgment and now the Mystery of the Shemitah. Um, God be with you. Godspeed. Uh, and thank you for, you know, awakening so many of us. Thank you.